Yannick knows exactly when, and obviously how, to catch himself. That is what separates him from the likes of you, who is sat there and just bewildered at how good he is and just your crap. It's fine being nasty to the audience sometimes. You can't always be like, oh, please like this, oh, I hope you like it, do you like, you know? Maybe it's like those porn videos where the, the person's like nasty to you. And you're like, ooh. No? All right. Right, we're gonna be dumbing it down. Right down, okay? Basically, he leaves it right up until the last moment. Like, you would have already, you would have already panicked, but he doesn't panic. He leaves it, leaves it, leaves it, leaves it. Then he catches himself, yeah? When he's about a meter off the water. And all of that time, he's waiting, 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 yeah? His kite is behind him, just slowing him down. Slowing him right down like a brake, yeah. People that share kiteboarding would panic way before, and they would start heli-looping. It's like, whoo, whoo. Getting faster and then slowing down as the kite goes behind him. And then getting faster and then slowing down as the kite goes behind him. Okay, but, uh, yeah. Yannick doesn't bother with that. He's just chilled. He's like, do you know what? I'm all right, yeah? I'll just wait until the kite takes me down, and then I will do my heli loop. Yeah, the kite doesn't rush in. The kite's like, fuck, that was a big issue, we go down? And Yannick's like, nah. All right, we'll go down when I say, okay? Not when you say. We're gonna do it my way this time, yeah? Because last time you did it your way, yeah, I landed in the car park. Now, how does he do that, you might ask? Will you figure that? Out? All right, I've gone and watched loads of videos and I figured it out. Basically, he just keeps the bar sheeted in when other people wouldn't. Yannick's basically like stalling the kite, keeping it in that little nice little precipice bit where it's not so far behind him that he has to heli loop, but it's not so deep in the window that it's pulling him more. Yeah, it's just sat behind him enough so it's slowing him down whilst he waits. He's got patience. He usually only does one heli loop, but it's a biggie and it's just way later than normal people would, to reiterate. Yeah, particularly if he's on his eight, like if he's gone massive, if he's like, you know, it's like a 25 metre loop, he will do a couple of heli loops, yeah? Don't just catch me out, don't just link it, proving me wrong, okay? I'm talking like, you know, bog standard classic Yannick, like he goes and does 100, yeah, 80 of them, he's just gonna do one heli loop. I think, sorry, I think his ability to do this comes from his like mad kite awareness. I think he always knows where it is. Yeah, even when it tries to, catch him out and get away from him he's like no nah. ah. when he's in this like free falling but sheeted in kind of phase he's not overtaking the kite okay he's just using it as a break he's like hang on hang on yeah because if he was to sheet out it would go whoosh, way behind okay which would slow him down loads but then he would have to heli loop you'd be forced to there's a point where you just fucking have to Okay. Otherwise, you're gonna hit the water, it won't have caught you, and your lines will literally be going like straight up wind. Do you want that? He keeps himself sheeted in like a chap. Look at that. Look at that, he's sheeted right the way in there, isn't he? He waits, wait, 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 wait now. Look at that. That's how he does it. That's how he does it. I figured it out by asking someone that knew. Perfect. Good, right, that's the end of this video. Big up me, my YouTube channel, it's so mint. Best YouTube channel.